Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to have you help me welcome an incredible businessman, an incredible teacher, and an incredible individual. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Robert Stevenson. When you look at it, you've got to execute flawlessly in every aspect of what you do or it doesn't happen. And it starts with you. You want to cause your company to fail? Say these words. That's the way we always done it. No, that's one reason why you're here, to find out new and different ways to do it. And that's what we've got to understand in business. Relentless pursuit of excellence to take it, because if you don't, if you don't like change, you're going to hate extinction. We got a lot of people out there that don't go find out how good they're doing. In my companies, every six months, we ask this question to our customers. In a perfect world, if we could provide you perfect service, what are we not providing? Because let me tell you something. A customer will not pick up the phone today and call you and complain. You know what they do? They leave. And getting them back is harder. So I've had the opportunity to interview over 10,000 employees, managers, and senior executives in over 250 different industries. I've, I've run companies. I've sold, as I said, in over 20 countries. And, and I've run my own sales organizations. And so I have an understanding of, of what I'm talking about. This is not stuff that I've just studied. These are real life experiences that I'm going to be sharing with my audience, and I think that's they, that they have a real appreciation for that. This is why people bring me in. The average lifespan of a multinational corporation in the United States is 40 years. Just 40 years. Japan and Europe, 12.5. You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, we gotta raise the bar. If you do what you've always done, you'll be gone. One of my clients, I remember Joe Mullins at Anheuser-Busch, he says, Rob, change is not a way of life, it is life. I said, Joe, why don't you share that with us? He said, we know what's gonna happen. We've decided to do it faster than our competition. That's the attitude that we're looking for. Right now, you can close your eyes and you can visualize the people back at your company that are the right ones, can't you? You can see them right now, the ones you can count on all the time. But you know what's scary? You can also close your eyes and visualize the wrong ones, can't you? You're saying to yourself right now, why in the world did I hire them? They were breathing at the time, okay? And you needed to fill that spot. The worst thing that you could ever do is fill that spot with the wrong person because they're going to cost you a customer. inspire them and motivate them. I love doing that, but then I want to give them things that they're capable of doing when they get home. Style is engaging. Uh, you know, everything he talks about, you can relate to on a daily basis. I'm, I'm definitely going to take a lot of stuff he talks about back home, so it's good stuff. It's the how-to that's most important. It's the content of telling them, here are the tangible things that you can do when you go back to your office that's going to make you successful. And by doing that, I feel you're going to have a valuable program that I can deliver. He's awesome. He was mentioning things that we never thought of in different light. A vibrant, energetic, knowledgeable. One thing that's neat about my industry, but also scary about my industry, is that I'm going to be up there for an hour to two hours sharing my soul. It's given all the experiences that I can to the audience in the room, and, and at the end, you're going to know how you did. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thank you so much, it's been an honor.